Hey people, Campfire Beer Baker here, back with another video. Okay, as you can see, I've got a new package. And this is from Mark Calvo. As you can see, I've got a new package from Mark Calvo of Calvo Customs. Calvo, so Mark, fantastic creator, master craftsman, excellent painter, really easy to deal with, and all round great guy, has moved into the goblin realm. So we're not just getting dwarfs, we're getting goblins now too. And when I saw these dwarves, and when I saw these goblin heads that Mark put up, I had to get involved. And I did. And these are what I ordered. Once again, Mark is extremely easy to deal with. You can tell him exactly what paints you want, if you want to actually have them painted. Otherwise, some people opt to get them sent without being painted because they want to paint them themselves. I will do that at some point. But yeah, Marcus sent me these goblins and I'm pumped to get into them. So let's do it. Glasses are already on so we can really see every detail. Well, so I can see every detail. Yeah, let's do it. Well, so let's get into it. All right. For the first one, really, really excited for these. I know what they look like already because you get amazing previews. Are you ready for the first reveal? Bow. Look at that. Granny Gobbo. Ah, oh, she looks fantastic. Look at that. Just simply awesome. Mark is a master craftsman, as I've said before. Look at the fine detail all the way around. Just excellent, look at that. The idea behind this one for me is that she's this retired war veteran, this legendary badass that has to come out of retirement because she's needed. She's needed by the Horde. And she won't take no stuff from Noglin because she knew Noglin's parents. And maybe his parents' parents. But yeah, badass, look at that. For the second. Oh. Bow, look at that. Another fantastic paint job. The theme ended up becoming red because from the previews that Mark always posts when he has new heads and he paints them, I was like, you know what? They look amazing. I'd like slightly different colors, not in terms of the skin complexion or the eyes or even the teeth. Well, in this case, but just a slight different color. And then before I knew it, the theme became red. The story behind that guy, another badass. Might end up being like a special team, you know? A special team of gobos. The trio, red team. All right, bow with the ah with the locks as well. Another supreme badass. Look at that. I'm gonna place her right. Look at the hold on. Look at the detail. Look at the fine detail. Honestly, Mark is brilliant. And look at that. That is the red team right here. The red team. Obviously, we got Thwick, Snag in the background. But it's all about these guys today. Let's get them on some bodies. You know what, just as I was about to get these heads on some bodies, I noticed that there was more to the package than I thought there was. So, let's see. Oh, wow. Mark is, look at this, boom. This is friggin' brilliant. Okay, so Mark has thrown in a, an extra here. Oh, Mark, man, you legend. Look at that. Now that is a majestic looking dwarf. One second, let me just move this. Had a bit of packaging on the right eye there. Look at that. That is phenomenal. Look at the paint job. I had no idea this was coming as well with the goblin heads. Supremely epic. Look at that. Look at the fine detail there. I'm really getting screwed for this camera now. Stupendous. Thank you, Mark. So I've got a bonus right here. I'm going to rest this fella up here. Fantastic. Thank you again, Mark. Thank you, Mark. That is awesome. A nice extra. That is, but it does not feel like an extra at all. That is a superb paint job. Such a nice surprise there, man. Thank you, Mark. I really appreciate that. Right, let's get these on some bodies. I'm going to have to get a dwarf body out as well. Okay, let's go. As you can see, look at these magnificent heads on these bodies. Just complete. I'm going to bring each one closer to the camera, but I just got to take a second, take a moment, just to appreciate the artistry of Mark Calvo. He is fantastic. I mean, these have... 
These were even better than I thought they would be and I knew they were going to be amazing. So let's start off with the far left, the locked warrior. Look at that. Stupendous. Works really well on this body. I'm going to work out exactly which bodies I want to put them on, but just for now, look at that. Just fantastic. Look at the textures and the hair. Just superb. Simply superb. And as Marco said, this is definitely the red team. He realised it and I was like, yeah, I'm going with a bit of a theme here. So yeah, and let's go with this fella here as well. But look at that, just a phenomenal figure. I can't wait to photograph these guys. If I wasn't heading out in a little bit to catch up with some friends, I would definitely, I would definitely know that the next few hours are going to be spent photographing these amazing figures. And then now we've got to go with Granny in the middle. The boss who even Noglin himself cannot order around. Look at that. Just amazing. Just fantastic. These are brilliant additions to any Mythic Legions collection, especially when you love goblins like I do. Mark Calvo of Calvo Customs. Thank you again, sir. And oh, I've got to show you the bonus. I could not forget the bonus. I mean, look at this. Look at this amazing bonus that Mark threw in it's there. Not the first time that Mark has threw a bonus in with the package, but look at that, just phenomenal. Excellent paint job, superb. And I never would have thought to get this character and I wouldn't have thought of these colors either. So it's such a beautiful surprise. Just place this head on this body, just to show you guys. Just, ah, oh, over the moon with these. 